75 million super yachts linked to Russian steel billionaire's auction off Gibraltar. A 65 million pound super yacht owned by a sanctioned Russian oligarch has attracted 63 bids of auctions in Gibraltar, in the first sales of oligarch assets since Putin invaded Ukraine in February. The 72.5 meter Angsoma was seized from steel billionaire Dmitry Pompiansky in March, following sanction by the UK, EU, and the US. The office of Admitri Sarshal in Ukraine said on Tuesday that 63 bids have been received for Angsomia, but refused to detail the value of the bids for the yacht, which features six luxurious guest cabins, a swimming pool, a 3D cinema room, gym, jacuzzi, and a fully equipped spa. The successful bidder will be selected by the Admiralty Marshal. But details of the bidder and the value of the offer will remain confidential. The court said in a statement, "Detail about the sale value of the vessel will be made available once the transaction has been completed, which would take place in approximately 10 to 14 days." The sale of Asomia has attracted controversy because it is sold not for the benefit of Ukrainian people, but for U.S. investment bank J.P. Morgan. Which claim Pompiansky owns it more than 20.5 million euros. Pompiansky was until March of this year the owner and chairman of the steel pipe manufacturer OAO TMK, a supplier to the Russian state-owned energy company Gazprom. The UK said the billionaire, who it said had billed up estimate 1.81 billion pounds fortune, was one of the oligarchs closest to Putin. The yacht. Was detained by the Gibraltar government after a legal claim from J.P. Morgan, which said Pompiansky Holding Company, Rien Investment, owns it more than twenty million dollars. J.P. Morgan said the fact the billionaire had been subject to the sanction means the terms of the loan had been breached because it illegal could not accept loans repayment from Rien, and asked the Gibraltar courts to detain and sell the yacht. There was an unexpected late surge by protective buyers around the world for vessel. Nigel Hoyer, brokers to the Admiralty Marshals of the Supreme Court of Gibraltar, who led the auction, told the Guardian last week, the yacht, which was designed by famed superyacht designer Alberto Pinto, was built in Dunya Yacht in Turkey in 2013. The boat. Which was originally named Red Square before being named Asioma, was available for other millionaires to charter for five hundred and fifty-eight thousand dollar a week. With its luxurious interior, vast array of onboard facility, and a highly trained and professional crew, a luxury yacht vacation on board motor yacht Asioma promised to be nothing short of spectacular. The charter listing states. The Azomia is the first seas luxury yacht known to be auctioned since the West imposed sanctions on powerful Russian after the February invasion of Ukraine. Azomia will be a watershed moment for assets that have bank financing against them, because all of the other banks will realize that the assets can be sold, and that they can get some or all of their money back. He said. He stressed it, however, that assets without financial claim against them. Which were seized by government because of sanction alone would be harder to sell. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.